just like the look you had last night? Uh, I mean, it was a look, so I mean, whenever you can get a look uh, with two seconds left is a plus, and um, felt good, I just rimmed out, so. What's the, just the good and the bad as you kind of reflect upon last night? Uh, I think the good was defense in the first half, uh, and I think in the third quarter we gave her up 12, and they went on a run, and that was kind of how they got back in the game, and we could have closed them out right there, so um, there's a lot that we looked back on, and uh, we're happy about, um, but there's obviously strikers that we just need to take care of. A lot of mid-rangers last night, you got a couple in there too. What's the balance between keeping up the volume for threes and then still getting to those those midi looks? Yeah, um, I mean, teams are trying to take away uh, the three-point, especially Minnesota. Um, they're hugged up on a lot of our guys. Um, so uh, just trying to balance when they attack the basket. Um, when's a good mid-range shot? Because a lot of mid-range shots aren't, aren't great. Um, so and obviously you want to shoot a lot of threes. Um, like Minnesota did last night because that, that ended up winning them the game. So, uh, obviously, you just need to find a balance that works for us. How enabled do you feel to sort of recognize your moments, take take some of those mid-ranges, create for yourself? Yeah, I know I'm a, I'm a capable scorer in the mid-range. Um, and I know that I'm capable from the three levels on the court. So, uh, we got a lot of guys that can put the ball in the basket. So, it's just picking my spots when um, I see something I like. Did it feel like you just had more room more space out there with Demar and, and De'Aaron getting so much attention? Uh, honestly, not really. Uh, I feel like I was kind of I was played tight um, with Julius on me, but uh, those guys. I mean, it's gonna differ game from game, so it's, it's gonna be interesting to see how other teams play it. Um, but. Yeah, I feel like there's going to be games where I have a lot of a lot more open looks. So. The numbers might change from game to game, but from a core and your offensive output as a team, do you feel like it's it's what you expect to have those type of numbers as a team game in, game out? Yeah, I think those would be guys that have the high end each night. Um, those would be guys that, I mean, it's not going to look like that box score each night. So um, those would be guys off our bench that are going to step up in a big way. And um, this would be, I mean, it's good to have that kind of depth. Um, on our team, uh, that are ready to go. And how do you look at the Lakers on uh, Saturday next matchup? Yeah, I mean they're they're a big team, physical. Uh, they rebound the ball well. Um, they they're playing good basketball so far, um, especially their game against Minnesota. So uh, we know that we're gonna have to be able to run in transition against them and just try and get their bigs up and down the court. Last one, Jordan. What you think guys kind of guys? Yeah, I mean it was really good. Uh, Felt like obviously opening that game, playoff game. So um, they bring that pretty much uh, the whole season. So um, it's exciting to get back on the court with that guy. Thanks, guys.